What is up YouTube? It's Die Hard here and uh just got home from work and I was looking at some gaming related stuff and I stumbled across an article about a five or twenty-four karat gold and it NES, okay? Uh, it's a Legend of Zelda's thirtieth anniversary. Uh, the first two Zelda games um, on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Uh, they had gold covered, gold colored cartridges, but as you see in this, uh, it's the console completely covered in gold, and, and that's that's pretty cool. Um, if you want to further read the, um, <clears throat> excuse me, if you want to read the post, then uh, I'll put the link in the description. I, I got the image from GameStops or um, GameSpot, not GameStop, but um, but yeah, so that's retro gaming. Um, I guess it'd be for the higher tiered people that could afford that. It's got a $5,000 price tag. That's pretty expensive for, uh, you know, depending on how many variations or uh, models are going to release. But um, just to put this out there, this is a hardcore t team deathmatch. I was running the KN44, obviously. But, uh, but yeah, so a 24 karat gold regular Nintendo that uh, apparently can I'm assuming it can play games I'm assuming it's not just decoration it's probably working um, which is cool but at this juncture I mean it's 2016 now and I, I mean yeah that's great you know 30 year anniversary for Zelda that's cool that's awesome and I had tons of fun playing uh, the NES years and years ago but Again, that was years and years ago, <laughs> and you know now we we live in a day and age where if you're playing a game at you know 480p or you know 480i or anything like that, anything that isn't you know 1080 or at least 720, you're kind of you know slacking and not doing so hot. But I think it's a cool concept. I I know many um, other consoles that would end up doing this as well. Um, basically, uh, this is what you get in the box. A 24 karat gold plated analog NT, which is the NES. Uh, you get a limited edition box. Uh, you get the Legend of Zelda, the original gold colored cartridge. Uh, you do get, um, instead of the old school coax plug-in, which worked on the Nintendo and the SNES and stuff, uh, you get like uh, the red, green, blue co or component cables, or else you get the HDMI upgrade. Like it probably has both ports, and then you get the full cable set or the HDMI cable. Um, okay, so there's only ten units that are made. So you know, at five thousand five thousand dollars a pop, fifty G's, um, you can get a much lower priced. Uh, analog NT for the price of $500 and you can add different different colors including gold and Famicom for an extra fee uh, for those of you that don't know the Famicom was the Super Nintendo before it was the Super Nintendo but that's a discussion for another day and like I said um, I'm gonna try to do a video once a day but I didn't do anything this weekend because I figured I'd take the weekend off but maybe this coming week I'll put something out every day. I don't know, it's just it's it's a little tricky for me to do it because sometimes I don't feel too motivated and I did pretty good in this game. This was during the double XP. I ended up going 17 and 6 and this was on the Xbox One. Um but but yeah, so uh 24 karat gold plated uh you know, NES. I know it's not like super groundbreaking news or any big release trailer or anything I mean there was some other news but they were kind of games that don't really interest me um, certain games don't hold my interest but um it you know it is what it is it I'm not saying it's a slow news week but I don't normally give gaming news as is so I I'm just covering stuff that I think is kind of interesting or something that I'd like to talk about and a 24 karat gold NES that's that's like the little kid in me you know going oh that's so cool because 
you know, I years ago it was gray and, and gray. It was light gray and charcoal gray. Those were those were your color combinations. But um, but yeah, guys. So let me know what you think. And if you want to read the full post, I have the description or the link down in the video description and all that good stuff. So and the, our teammate here just totally raped this team. But uh, all right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. I will see you guys next time.